I'm here from the committee and also Screamin' Eagles. Hope you've all survived COVID and you're all safe out there. Everyone's wondering what's happening. Well, here's a little bit of a heads up. This festival, this is what's happening. We will be spreading it out. Pioneer Park last year had the big stage and Harley, all the Harley stuff will still be there. So all the Harley trucks, we'll have our merch up there. We'll also have all our raffle prizes up there. We'll have a kids amusement park up there. We'll have a market. We will have the car show and shine, the amazing chase, have a silent disco, all happening up in that precinct and you can wander up in there, but the big concert won't be there. The entertainment this year will be spread out. So we're spreading it out across Bright and all the local other little towns around there and we're putting some money back into the community there. So you'll be able to go and see shows, over 16 bands, um, 24 sessions across these live venues. That makes it happen. So the capacities of those venues might be 200, 300, depending on, on how many we can fit in per square COVID regulation, blah, blah, blah. So what we want to do is give everyone as much fun as possible. We're going to run buses around town. It'll be a small donation for you to get your butt and you can get around town and you can plan all your own entertainment. So that's what's going to happen with, with our entertainment. We'll still do have our, our raffle will happen on Sunday night and that will be live streamed. So we can't get everybody up there, but you'll be able to see what happens. So that'll still be drawn up at Pioneer Park at uh, six o'clock on Sunday night. So entertainment venues, we've got the Port Punker Hotel, we've got the Bright Golf Club, we've also got the Bright Brewery, we've got the Bright Footy Club, we've got the Wandy Pub, and we've also got the Star Hotel. So in the Star, we'll be running some comedy on the Sunday afternoon, but uh, on Friday night, we will be running sessions. Saturday, we'll do some matinee sessions. Saturday night, some more sessions. Sunday, some matinees, and Sunday night as well. So there's be enough for everybody to see one, two acts, whatever you want to do, you can play on your own weekend. The bands we've got coming, it's a great lineup. Obviously, you know, we are limited by how much we charge versus how many people we can get through, through, the, get through the gate to make it affordable. So committees worked very, very hard to make this happen. And big thanks to the council and the venues and everybody who's made it, and also to a lot of the artists who've helped us out. So here's a heads up who's playing. Trocky Starfish, they are coming back. They're doing two shows, Friday and Saturday night. Screaming Eagles will be up there. We're doing four shows over the weekend. So we've got uh, In Excessive, those boys that were up here, they're coming back. We've got Cool Change, they're coming back. We've got The Bad Loves. We've got uh, The Other Show as well with the Chantuzies. So that's one big special show for all the girls. We've got Jacuzzi Masterpiece and we've got the Nicky Bombers Bustamento out at the Wandy Pub. So all you funk and reggae uh, fans, you've got all that. We've got some of the TV stars coming as in the, those voices. We've got Jimmy Couples who is off The Voice, Reese Maston who is off TV, he's coming back. And we've also got Taylor Henderson coming out as well. We're gonna take you back to the 80s with Brian Mannix and the Androids. So they'll be playing out at the, uh, the Paul Punker Hotel. We've got the Finn Brothers who do great Crowded House stuff. We've got a Whitney Houston show. We've got a Blues Brothers show uh, with, um, featuring George Capanaris. And George is also doing a night at the Wapra which is uh, one of his comedy show at the Star Hotel at the Pinewood. So lots and lots of stuff, lots of, you know, there'll be some other names dropping. Wilbur Wilde's coming to play sax with us. There's lots of things happening over the weekend. So you're gonna have a great time. You've got to plan your own weekend. Now, we ask you all for your patience because, you know, if something happens, another outbreak, we don't know, you know, we could get shut down tomorrow. So we take, you know, we, we appreciate your patience and we understand that, you know, this year's a little bit different but uh, we still are trying our hardest to make it happen for you. So keep your eyes open for those tickets. They'll be out very, very shortly. We're just finalizing the last little bits and then uh, get in and get as many as you can and have a great time. We'll see your smiling faces up at the Friday Days Festival. See you later. Oh, by the way, Dale Ryder from Boom Crash Opera and Jason Singh, the Voice of Super Group will be playing as well. And Mick Feeling's coming back. And Susie O'Hearn, who all sang on the Brighter Days song. So see you all in Brighter.